Hi, I'm Connor Malone, uh, Vice President of Engineering at Hive Solutions, and I'm here today to show you a little bit about our Hive 1312 chassis. Uh, we've got 12 6 terabyte uh, helium drives from HGST. Uh, we've got a single socket processor to front end that storage. We also have a boot drive in the box as well. Uh, two 10 gig ports up front. Uh, you'll notice with this layout, it's uh, very novel and distinctive in terms of the front I.O. Uh, up at the front of the box, power plugs here up front, network connections are here. Everything you'd ever want to do is up at the front of this box. Uh, what our partner uh, DDN, Data Direct Networks, has done is taken our box, uh, uh, very high capacity storage, a lot of performance here, and layered their software on top of it. It's a great building block for their solution. And uh, you can see there's a lot of uh, interesting things packed into one small, small package. Uh, tell us about the front end. Is that for maintenance and servicing of the units? Yeah, we moved everything up front for a couple of reasons. One is for uh, ease of serviceability, so you're only walking up to one side of the cabinet, uh, not running back and forth, up and down the row, back and forth, back and forth, the data center dance. So serviceability is improved. It also helps us a lot with cooling uh, by running the hot air over the, the hottest components first. Um, and it really allows us to have a more uh, efficient cooling system and reduce the power it requires to, to cool it over course of its lifetime. Hi, my name is uh, Ben Broderick Phillips. I'm a software engineer at Nebula, and we're a private cloud computing company. We make a turnkey hardware appliance that helps you deploy OpenStack in your data center. Uh, what we're demoing here today is we've got our system working with the high 1500 series servers, the open compute Windows Hub servers. It's, um, it's basically a tray, and you've got two server sleds in here. And we've got that, this is our Nebula One cloud controller, and we've got that hooked up here, and we're running a private cloud off these two nodes and a bunch of Supermicro JBud storage trays, um, all coming through the LSI SaaS switch, which is what we're demoing here today. It's a more storage-dense architecture for private cloud. At Nebula, we came, uh, we're a company that came out of NASA from the OpenStack Foundation and big open source project, uh, open community around cloud. And part of the reason we're really excited about Hive and about Open Compute is the same reason. It's it's an open source project. There's um, that kind of initiative that's you know a little more. It's not just about business. It's about caring about the world and caring about doing good and making um, products that are going to benefit more than just the bank. Um, so we were excited about that. We're really excited because they have the same kind of goals that Nebula has. We're supporting a big open source project. We're founded on a big open source project, which is OpenStack. Hive comes from Open Compute. It's a perfect marriage. Thank you. How can we find out more about Nebula? Go to nebula.com, uh, our website, check out more info, or follow us on Twitter. Thank you. All right, so now that you've seen the demo inside that Nebula demo rack, we're going to show you the inside of the High 1500 in a little bit more detail. Uh, what we did here is we took the standard OCP 2.0 building blocks, uh, but packaged them up in a bit skinnier chassis so it can rack mount in a standard rack mount environment, as you just saw in the prior uh, clip. Uh, so we had to narrow it in a little bit. Still has the same OCP compute sleds here. You can see two of them with two processors in each sled. Uh, we have room for uh, add-in cards up front, as, you, as example by these uh, Fusion I.O. cards in this particular box. Uh, single shared, uh, very high efficiency power supply, uh, 80 plus platinum. And uh, very easy to service. The nodes just slide in and out uh, as such, uh, made into a, a back plane in the back that distributes the power from the power supply. Uh, 60 millimeter fans for very efficient cooling. It's very tough to beat. And as you can see, follows the general uh, OCP principles of uh, vanity free computing. No lids, front, everything you don't need is not here, uh, just the things you do need.